Hey guys, Cindy Otter here with My Artsy Endeavors. How are you doing today? I'm doing really well. Um, what we're here for is we are going to play with uh, Gina's design team this month. And um, what this month is all about is mark making. So I've got several sets of Gina's stamps here. Um, if you're interested in any of these stamps, as you see, I use them. Uh, definitely um, check out her Etsy shop because she's got all of these stamps there. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I have a whole bunch of jelly prints and just leftover papers and whatever. And I'm going to take these and I'm going to make them into something useful. Um, I'm going to give them some mark making, but I'm going to do it with Gina Stamps. So I plan on using these in my art, you know, coming forward, whenever. But I thought, hmm, this is a great opportunity to get some of these looking like some background papers. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward. I hope you guys enjoy and I will chat with you at the end and we'll see what we've done. Have fun.
<laughs> All right, guys, so um, I planned on doing a lot more, but I'll be honest with you, this stamping um, is hurting my shoulders and my fibro. So it's okay, I've got a few done. Now, I know mark making, a lot of people think it's like an abstract mark making. That's not what I'm doing. I made marks, like for example, this one has a bunch of hearts and it says laughter on it. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use my jelly roll pens right here. And I'm gonna play around with some of these marks, make more of them stand out. Um, this I did a bunch of flowers. I thought it'd be really cool to cut them out. So I'll do that um, and just play. Some of these, like these little vines, I am just going to pretty much cut them out and then I'll be able to apply them to a page. So yeah, this is to me, here again, a piece of gold that I just threw some, you know, little branches on a couple jars. I will be able to use these in the, in the future on any of my projects. This was a jelly print that, I don't know, I think it was the reverse jelly print on this. And then I just put some spinning wheels on it I thought it was really cool. This one is kind of hard to see. Again, I'll be playing with the jelly rolls, but there's a bunch of red on here. There's some uh, and signs, harmony, um, you know, just stuff to play with. And again, all I have to do is rip this apart, <clears throat> pardon me, and I can use it as a background. So same here, um, just stuffs. I just used a bunch of random uh, stamps of Gina's. And then this one I did on the deli paper. And again, I'm going to use some um, jelly rolls on these. So I am not going to torture you by um, making you sit here and watch all of this. So what I'll do is I will come back at the end and I'm going to show you how these pages turned out. All right, I hope you enjoyed. All right, guys, so I've been playing around with these. I used some of the gel pen just to do my thing. Some of them I just kind of lightly cut out. These are the flowers. Now, I know um, some people are going to say, well, this isn't mark making. Well, to me it is because I'm going to use these marks. I love this. I think that turned out great on the gold. Um, this it actually has laughter in there, and it has the red hearts. I kind of like that as a muted background. Um, I cut out the two jars. Here's some of the leaves that I just, you know, I colored in a few and some of them I just want to stay the same. Now the reason I'm showing you these is because, see this one I just played around with colors. Just had fun with it. Um, I'm going to create a page now using some of this as my background and my mark making stuffs. So I just wanted to show you what they look like before I started playing with them. All right, so now I know the book that I'm going to play in um, is actually was supposed to be used for my creative year all year, although I've went in a dozen different directions with that. So this is the book I'm going to play in. This, again, was supposed to be my, um, 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 what did I say, my creative year for 2019, but it just didn't quite work out that way. I mean, some of it did, some of it didn't. So I'm going to play in here. Let me see. Yeah, let's play right here with this page. And we've got a pocket here. So we're going to see what we'll do with that pocket. But I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through the process. I hope you guys enjoy. And we will chat at the end.
So here's what we did. We did our mark making on paper and again this is just the way I felt like doing mark making this time. I wasn't really looking for you know just a background with random you know pieces. I just I played a little bit and that was fun. So then I ended up making these pay this page out of those um, random mark making. Again this blue one in the back has laughter and it had these hearts on it. I decided to paint those metallic which I thought was kind of neat just to bring them out a little bit. And this says remember the now. And of course uh, Gina's jar with her little bitty flowers and this I butterfly I dug out of my stash. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Don't forget to check out the other artists um, throughout Gina's design team. Um, we all have so so much so totally different takes on you know what the prompt is of the month um, but definitely check them out hope you guys have enjoyed don't forget to have fun that's what life's all about and happy creating i'll talk to you soon bye bye